because milk is very poor. So unfortunately, we're <laughs> we're just eating rice with slacho. Yes, that's all we eat today. Hi everybody, this is Milky. Welcome back to another Pumpkin Days Let's Play. Well, today we have some new features added in Pumpkin Days. I love how many updates it happens for Pumpkin Days, and we have some interesting ones such as food item can be used as decor. Oh my God, I have no idea how that's gonna look, but I'm going to decorate my farm with bunch of pumpkins. Hopefully, I can do that. And let's try all these new features out today. And let's get started. Well, first thing first, let's check out the flower basket because I do want some nice little flower basket to decorate my beautiful farm. So let's buy it and see how it goes. Also, by doing the quest, I got a silver flower drop earring for Nicola from Nicholas. I'm so happy. I, I, I want to try it out right now. But before that, we need to unlock our camera so you guys can actually see me. And then let's try out this uh, earring. <gasps> Isn't it cute? I love it. Well, unfortunately, I can't go closer, but it's so cute. I love the earring. I'm not sure whether this is one of the new earrings. Also, well, wow, the flower basket looks great too. Well, I want to put it in my farm soon. Let's go to my farm. Ooh, oopsie. Also, one of the new updates that's really, really friendly to somebody who have an animal is uh, it, said, it was mentioned that there's some regrowable um, grasses around the fence that we can chop down and use it to feed our animal. Well, I just found one and there's I think there's more right there. <gasps> that's amazing. I love it. This is our some great food for my animal and we don't even need to pay for it. Isn't that awesome? I don't know how often they regrow, but you know what? I will chop it all down and see how how often does it grow. Be before I thought maybe we need some special processor in order to create it, but this is nice and easy, isn't it? Oh, almost use all my energy for it. I should uh, I should upgrade my tours for for this one day. Oh oh no! I think I'm about to pass out. Ah, <gasps> gosh. Well, as Barbara said, that was a happy little accident. <laughs> I was so happy collecting the four dollars. I accidentally passed out, so I just saved and reload. Luckily, I saved right here, and I accidentally found out an interesting thing. So the stuff they sell in the shop, yeah, they changes uh, each time we come. And I just found out if you don't like what they sell or they didn't sell what you like, you can just save and reload, and it will refresh what they sell and. Uh, if you save and reload enough, you will get the item you love. That's so nice. Even the quest too. Last time he didn't have a delivery request, but after saving and load a few times, I got the delivery request. So now with the food decoration, I was able to do something like this. Jung jung, I love it. <laughs> wow, because milk is very poor, so unfortunately we're <laughs> we're just eating rice with slacho. Yes, that's all we eat today. But I love how it looks, and I would love to decorate it more with a bunch of cakes and food. Um, so it feels more family like. Well, I hope in multi server that we can, or playing with other people, I can actually sit down and uh, looks like we're having a tea party. Wouldn't that be fun? But so far, I'm loving this food decoration. I wanted to put pumpkin around the farm, but unfortunately, it seems like the raw food I wasn't able to place it down. But, anyways, that's a cool. Super duper cool updates. Um, based on the patch note, there seems to be some new socks and the clothes item unlocked. And I almost never got a socks. I'm not sure that's just because I I never bought it or this is something new. But some of the socks are really really cool, like the purple dotty one or the black and white streak. I'm thinking maybe let's get a black and white streak or um for our socks. Why not? Let's buy it. Oh, I love the new socks, and we can even get gloves. Oh no, the gloves is, so is sold out. But there are some cute pants and skirts that I really, really love. I love how many, well, how many items and clothes we can buy. It just really feels amazing. Well, I tried to steal from the Junk Corp again today, and it seems like I got the same thing. So I guess the, the items are the same for everybody. It's pretty nice to get the liquid drunks. I'm not sure whether it's a punishment if we didn't buy it and we just drink it. Should be fine. But ever since I was upgraded to the uh, meteor tours, I find out it's uh, usually energy is uh, less of a problem for me right now because uh, we didn't, we don't. There's no much things that needs energy for us now. 
also I think the force just has been adjusted a little bit. It started out way way faster than before, and I love it. I love how the pumpkin days just keeps improving and becoming better and better. This is so crazy! I actually dropped down with my horse in the bottom of the sea, and it looks amazing. I wish I can show you guys earlier, but I am losing energy, so I have to. Oh, I don't want to see Takako again. Help! I'm stuck. But I was in the Wawu Island. I can't believe they teleported me all the way back here. I was going for the deep ocean fishing, but guess that's not happening today. Oh gosh, I got another main quest, and it's funny about the wine again. I think last time I was、uh, trying to get the wine from the statue, and now we need to get some wine at the bar, and it should be left at the bar counter. Well, oh, there we go. I saw it. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know how many wine I have delivered for the sisters. It's funny. Thank you. Well, there we go. We got it, and it seems like we got something special. What is it? A chocolate pie. I love that. Thank you, sister. And it seems like when I have a good enough relationship with the character, every time I talk to them, they keep giving me gifts, and I've been having. I've been just talking to the town people around and gotten tons of ice creams. I wonder is there anything else they would give other than ice cream? Because I just have so many. Well, thanks a lot for the comments. Because before I was really, really silly. Every time I need new seeds, I just go and buy seeds. But actually, what I could do is just use seed maker to make more seeds. I was so silly about it before to keep buying seed from the from the shop. I think as long as we get all the seeds that we needed. Then all we need to do is just putting the seeds to make,、uh, putting it in the seeds maker and get more of them instead of keep buying it. Well, you can see I'm stacking on the sugar beets just because I think we probably will need a lot of sugar soon. So I'm just stacking on them. <laughs> well, if you don't know, I'm actually a pretty big hoarder, so I like stacking stuff, especially. Um, for farming games, I love stacking all the items inside, so I can, so I know I'm ready when there's a test for it. But I probably has been hoarding too much ice cream or, um, too many. Let's see, too many potatoes. I got tons of potatoes. Well, I'm going to sell all the ice cream, and then also I think I want to ship the. Coconut. I think coconut is one of the things that can be used to unlock oil presser, which I really, really do super duper want. Well, I think that's it for our today's episode. I love my new table and decoration, and all the new features that has been added for Pumpkin Days. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.